Hi, in this session, we will see the address component of a smart form. When you right click on the window, you can see there is an option as address. So, we can print the address of a customer or a vendor or an organization by using the address number field of the respective master. As we know in the customer master, there will be anyone, there is a field called ADNR. Okay, that is contained the address number and the address is stored in ADRC table. But instead of selecting individual name, address, email ID, telephone number, this is the simplest way to print the complete address. Okay, so take an example here. I have a customer master with my name, and this is the customer ID. Okay, here I have my name, I have my address, email ID, and the dummy number I have put it here. Okay, this is my customer record. If we check this record in the SS69. In K1 table, for this customer, we have the address number that is the ADRNR. Okay, so using this number, we'll print the address. So how to do that? Go to transaction. Our uh, transaction code is smart form. This is our smart form. Go to change mode. In the global data. I will work area that is gs underscore kna1 the type will be kna1 okay now either i can write the code in the initialization block either i, either I can write my code in this block okay the system is a little slow Wait. And then I can write my code here or simply I can create a new node. Okay, so we'll create a new node. Right click here. Create flow logic program lines. Okay, in the output enter as gs underscore k1. Select single all from KNA1 into corresponding fields of GS underscore KNA1 where Kunar equal to I am passing the hard code value in real time you have to pass the actual value where Kunar customer code is equal to this. Okay, so what I'm doing here, I'm passing the customer ID here and selecting the record from KNA1. Now, as we know, in the KNA1, there is a field called ADRNR. Okay, now simply right click here. Create address. Okay, here we can pass the dynamic value. So gs underscore kn1 ad wait let me push the value oh that's the dynamic value i pass the value here wait here in the ampersand pass it value gs underscore kn1 so i did not allow select wait let me check Okay, what we'll do, we'll display a variable, simple variable here. Declare one variable that is gv underscore adrnr type adrnr. Okay, go to our code logic here gv underscore adrnr and to that variable gv underscore adrnr was the value of gs underscore kna1 adrnr now go to address here ampersand add gv underscore adrnr okay 
se check so check and activate okay so what we have done we have passed the value through a variable execute so you can see the system is printing the address as per the address number this is my name okay and this is the address okay so that address is coming here otherwise what will happen we have to print the integer variables so this is simplest method if you want to print a complete address okay so using the address field we can do that so in this way we have finished with session printing of address with the address component thank you